da 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 making our christmas memories good morning you guys so it is friday morning today is the day of our smoking and grilling little holiday dinner so tonight the company is going to mccormick and schmitz <laughs> and i don't even know how i don't even know how strict the dress code is how strong how aggressive <laughs> the dress code is because i mean like you know I want to get dolled up and look nice and stuff, but I don't necessarily feel like wearing a dress or anything. So I'm going to look that up and just check it out, see kind of what the dress code requirement is, okay? Um, but right now, I got an email from Beats by Deb stating that I didn't complete my order yesterday, okay? And I'm like, how did I not complete my order, boo? But I remember I was trying to order something, you know, on my phone or whatever. I was like on Instagram or something, and I was going to order some more of the brushes. Y'all, these brushes, I'm like, ciao. All my life, I've been looking for brushes like this that are super flat, super thin. I don't even do as many cut creases as I used to, but child, had I had these brushes when I was doing cut creases, let me tell you, her brushes are the flattest, the thinnest, the most amazing cut crease brushes. I use these to carve out my eyebrows now. Now that I don't even draw my eyebrows in anymore, I, I just carve them out with concealer. Yo, Beats by Deb. And I'm, you know, she's the cut crease queen. So she has these brushes. Um, I think, what are they called? Let me, let me pull up the order right now so that I can tell you what these different brushes are called and you know your girl needs her glasses okay yeah so you know if you really heavy into doing cut creases and stuff so she has the concealer brushes and she has the cut crease brush and I think the concealer brushes are the one that's shorter so you see how there's one shorter and one longer so yeah, I think the concealer brush is a shorter one and the cut crease brush is a longer one. Honey, I don't know, but your girl needs some more of these brushes expeditiously, okay? I used that. I was like, man, it's so perfect. It's so precise. And I think they're like seven bucks a pop or something like that. But when I tell you, I'm about to give me a few more because I used to... um. My favorite brush was one that came in the BH Cosmetics marble set. This has always been my favorite brush for cut creases and, you know, uh, carving out my brows and stuff. But as you can see, this one is nowhere near as flat and as thin as her brush. So, y'all... Let me... I'm about to hurry up and buy some more before y'all go buy them out. Because, honey, these brushes are the truth. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and see if I can finish doing that. Um, so yesterday, as you guys saw in the little clip, <laughs> I got a random um, delivery from Amazon. And so I got those cute little canisters. Love them. They're so cute. I just put like some little candy, little cookies in there or whatever. But, you know, you can use them for whatever, flour rice sugar cornmeal i mean they're really really nice i think they're cute and that little <laughs> around the neck um you know little thing for my camera i was playing with that thing last night and it was just like this is perfect so i probably use that when i want to film stuff in front of me and i still want my hands free it's a, a crazy wonky little gadget, but it definitely is something that will come in handy. Like when I'm doing shop my stashes and stuff like that, and I want to dig through my drawers and stuff without constantly moving my camera, you know, moving my lighting and all that stuff. I think it'll, it'll work out nicely. So anyway, that's what I'm doing right now. 
Um, let me see if I can find. So yeah, we have a little holiday dinner at McCormick, McCormick and Schmidt's. It is so crazy to me that we actually, you know, have the business and have employees and all that stuff. That's still amazing to me. It's it's such a blessing and it's also such a um, responsibility. It can be nerve wracking sometimes just to know that you are responsible for employees. <laughs> you know, for people's paychecks and people's livelihoods and stuff. It can be nerve wracking, but it's truly, truly a blessing. So I am very thankful for that. So I'm going to go ahead and complete this Beats by Deb order before this video go out and it gets her brushes get sold out and then I'll be mad because I can't buy no more. <laughs> And then I'm gonna look at this dress code. So hold on, y'all. Okay, so I'm looking at this uh, McCormick and Schmicks. <laughs> McCormick and Schmicks dress code. It says business casual. Business attire most common. Nice jeans and proper shoes are likely okay. Um, dressy, classy, seafood. You know, so I think, shoot, because I done, since I stopped working in an office environment, I done gave a lot of my stuff away, you know, Goodwill or to my daughter. But, I mean, I can wear a dress. I just don't want to wear a dress. And it's cold. I think I'm just going to put on like some black, some nice black jeans and a nice, um, really pretty blouse or whatever. I'm sure I'll show you guys what I'm going to wear um, tonight. You know, just dress it up. So, make it look fancy or whatever. So, yeah, I'm going to do that. Got to do my makeup. And it's actually not that early right now. It's actually 1230. Okay. I didn't go to bed till like 3, 3.30 last night or in the morning. <laughs> my husband woke up in the middle of the night and came in here. Child, I was sitting in here swatching palettes. He was like, what is wrong with you? I was straight up in here swatching palettes looking for a specific color story because I was trying not to buy a palette. I was specifically looking for these certain gray tone um, shadows and shimmers and stuff because somebody mentioned the Mary Jane palette from Melt in a video I was watching and y'all know just the power suggestion, honey. I was like, do I have that palette? I think I want that palette. So I'm on Sephora getting ready to buy the dang on palette. And I'm like, child, you know you got them shades somewhere. So anyway, I was up at three o'clock in the morning swatching palettes, just enjoying my life. But anyway, so yeah, that's why I got up. Got up this morning, seven o'clock. The gardener woke me up and I guess I went back to sleep because I showed up, didn't wake up again until 11. And now here I am, bright-eyed and bushy-tailed, trying to figure out what I'm doing for today. So, yeah, that's what today is looking like, y'all. Um, I think I'm going to do, like, a dark, smoky eye today. You know, since I was digging, looking for those shades, I think I'm going to do some type of, like, smoky smoke something. I pulled out my Revolution Midnight Lux palette, and the only thing with Revolution is you just don't know about the quality okay sometimes they straight they good they work sometimes they don't and more often times than not they kind of don't but there are some shades in here that i kind of want to you know get in my mix so it's like the gray this here this here those are really pretty this is pretty too you know it has the darker shades over here so it got some cute little shades up in here that i was thinking about using and then i also um pulled out my car of beauty this one is the desert oasis this one just has a gorgeous color story just period you know these shades here but it also has like some of those gray tone smokiness going on 
So, you know, it don't take much to do a smoky eye, but I want to make sure I get like that gray in there. And then I pulled this. This is from Ammo Cosmetics. Um, it's some glitter. Gorgeous. I think this will look so pretty on my lid with like a gray smoky eye. Um, yeah, they sent me this like when I placed an order a long time ago and I just never used it, but they just sent this little sample to me. So pretty. So anyway, those are my thoughts. I got a delivery today from Adept Cosmetics. So I'm assuming this is their latest palette that I purchased. Y'all want me to open it right quick? This is their latest purchase um, or their latest purchase. This is their latest palette, I believe, because I know I bought it and it said it wasn't supposed to ship until February, but Adept Cosmetics is good for shipping, you know, given like a far out date for their stuff and then able, you know, being able to ship it sooner. So let me just take a quick look at this palette. At these pennies. Mm -hmm. I used to get PR from Adept Cosmetics, but probably since I'm not really doing, you know, I haven't really been doing the makeup thing hard and heavy. They're like, we ain't sending her nothing. <laughs> you know, which is fine with me. Because like I've always said, I buy what I want to buy. Use what I want to use. Okay. Oh, this is cute. Look at this. They got the packaging. You know, they becoming real innovative with their packaging and stuff to help it to not break. Oh, plastic packaging. I really uh, fell in love with the um, color of this palette. I love, you know, all their palettes, the styles of their palettes that they've been coming out with. Dang, can I get this off? Yeah, let me get something to get this off with. Okay, so, ooh, ain't she pretty? That red, yo, that red, oh, gorgeous. It's the Amunet New. The Amunet New, if that's how you pronounce it. Oh, she's pretty. Dang. Oh, and see, they just protecting everything. Okay. Adept, I'll see you. They got this little plastic covering over the whole palette. So see. And their shadows are um oh like you guys you see the like um little Egyptian little Egyptian thing in there. So their, their shadows are magnetic. Oh, I see. Okay, so I see from the names. So this is what this palette looks like. Super duper pretty. I'm not about to get going because y'all, I will start acting like I'm doing a makeup video and start swatching and talking about it. But anyways, it's really, really pretty. So this is their latest palette. I'm so glad I grabbed it. Can't wait to use it. Might try out some of them shades tonight. So anywho, um, yeah, I need to get my life together. I need to eat me some lunch, figure out what I'm going to wear, which as soon as I do that, I'll show you guys. And then um, before I know it, it'll be time for me to start getting ready for tonight. So yeah, I'll talk to y'all later. Y'all, I'm having me some leftover skeddies for lunch. I put a little bit of cheese in here, made me some little butter toast, and I'm going to go ahead and get my little grub on. This should hold me until dinner tonight at McCormick and Schmix. <laughs> Leftover spaghetti, y'all know it be hitting.
Y'all, don't try to do no workout after you eat a bowl of spaghetti. Y'all, I'm sitting here folding clothes, you know, trying to do what I'm supposed to be doing today. Watching hubby, you know, his latest video. And I'm sitting here looking like, hold up. Them wings look good. <laughs> it was such a good idea for me to kick him out the house with his filming y'all because i sure enough didn't get to taste not near wing i'm like wait a minute i didn't have none of them wings and nobody bring me no wings i didn't get to sample no wings <laughs> okay but y'all should be proud of me though i'm doing the laundry today <laughs> folding it and i'm gonna put it away so anyway yeah, child. Let me call the office and see if they got any leftover wings. Look at this. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. See, didn't nobody bring me near honey barbecue wing this week. Yeah, I'm going to have a little discussion with hubby because, child, I like wings. Anyway, let me finish folding my clothes. Okay, y'all. I'm being somewhat productive, okay? I have... Um, what did I do? I worked out. Had me some lunch. Folded my clothes. <laughs> and now took me a shower now I need to um do something with this face it'd be just my luck my husband call and be like oh we rescheduled the holiday dinner because we're just so so busy today because when I tell you that they are busy getting the cookbooks completed and ready for shipping they are busy okay so yeah and I have like five million palettes on my table you guys this Natasha Denona face palette, mm, I'm dying to use this. I am. It is so stinking pretty. It's so gorgeous. I know y'all seen it. I know y'all seen it. I just, I think that would be such a beautiful blush and highlight. I don't want to, but you know, I don't want to do a warm eyelid today. I want to do something cool tone. So I showed you guys the other palettes that I was thinking about earlier. I got this Charlotte Tilbury. <laughs> Tilbury. Why do I always say that? Charlotte Tilbury. Uh, this is the Smoky Eyes Are Forever. You know, the new, like, I guess, is it the holiday palette or something? So, you know, I can kind of work over here. I've never used any of her shadows before. And then I have this ColourPop. This one is, is it called Ballad? Y'all know I ain't got my glasses on, so anyway. But I got this one from ColourPop. Definitely beautiful, cool, gray, smoky situation. I know y'all like, girl, you done went from Charlotte Tilbury to ColourPop. I, I just love makeup, all makeup, okay? I don't want to use this. This is warm tone. Uh, Glam Mood Night Out from Revolution Pro. I got this, but I really don't want to do no purple because I just did purple. I guess I'm just going to stick with just picking and choosing different colors to create this gray smoky situation. So I'm going to go ahead and do that and then I'll come back, show you guys my look, show you what I am wearing tonight. And then I'll probably give y'all a little footage of dinner tonight as well. All right, so talk to y'all later. Okay, you guys, I done went from having plenty of time to now I'm rushing. <laughs> so I'm just using my Urban Decay All Nighter. I'm gonna rush and get dressed. Hopefully I can show you guys what I'm wearing. Okay, you guys, I'm totally going to have to invest in a full-length mirror because I know y'all can't see nothing right now. But I have on this cute little, like, pink and peach, you know, off-the-shoulder top. As you can see, I have gold accessories to go along with it. I'm going to have to change my purse in the car. I have this cute little peach handbag that I'm going to wear. Just went with some black jeans and 
some black boots. <laughs> so I'll try to get a better shot for you. Maybe hubby can get it for me, but this is it. And this is the makeup look. So this is it for tonight's look. I'm rushing, I know my hubby is like, let's go. But anyways, I'm on some black jeans, some boots, flat boots for comfort. This little off the shoulder, peachy, you know, kind of pinky top. And then I have gold accessories, earrings, necklace. And then this is my makeup for tonight. So, oh, and I gotta switch my purse, look on, cause we're running late. <laughs> so. Let's go. Y'all, I cannot believe that I'm rushing. <laughs> or I ended up rushing. I was trying to film this eye look, so ain't no telling how that video gonna end up, but What's your name? yeah. Now I was talking to the people telling them no. I can't believe I'm rushing. When I just been kinda like having a lackadaisical day. So anyways, I'm gonna switch out this stuff in my purse. Try and get myself together. Watch out, because you come to copyright music. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> You got to take a picture of the first one, so right. five years from now we can right. see how big. Right, exactly. Right. When the table is full. Hey, when we all toasting to uh, yeah. selling that, right. to selling the next big thing. That's right. <laughs> Good to see you again. Good to see you too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
How you doing? I'm Justin. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I've been to you. I'm good. <laughs> There's more. <laughs> I should have put my name in the back. <laughs> That's nice. It smells really good. Yeah. You want to smell it? That smells good. You all like this? Yeah. Yeah, I already know. I love Mmm. Oh, that smells good. How can you know me this well in six months? That smells really good. Oh, I like this. That's not cute. <laughs> really? <laughs> really? Oh, you want to smell this one? Pass it around. That's Thank pretty. You. She said pass it around. Right. Pass it around. Okay. That's it's pretty. a candle. Uh, yes, you got more? You can't smell it? No, I, I do smell it. I was trying to squeeze it, but it's like glass. Very good. Pretty. Yeah. I don't want to miss it. Oh. 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 She's loving it. Yeah. Oh. 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 Oh
hey, 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 Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I use everything he got. Yeah. Yeah. That right there, that raised the game. Hey, Chief, that raised the game. Raise what, raise what game? <laughs> Thank you, Bree. can't find our car we lost <laughs> we on p2 think we supposed to be on yeah because see we're all behind right following the crowd <laughs> following the crowd we done got lost okay you guys i am back from the holiday dinner for smoking and grilling with AB. And I feel like it was such a success, just an amazing time with the employees and their loved ones and us just being able to get together, share with them and do that for them. It was just an amazing, amazing night. So much fun, such a blessing. <sighs> and now that's over and done with. I'm about, I already took my clothes off as you can see. I'm about to take this makeup off and start editing this vlog so you guys will have something to watch. But yeah, oh, I wanted to let you guys know um, the scent that I wore tonight. I wore this Alt Girl Gone Wild number 88. Is that what that says? <laughs> this one that I showed in uh, my vlog a, a couple of vlogs back. Y'all, I can't even talk. I'm tired. It's late. I only have one Long Island, but I can feel it. I'm tired. <laughs> so anyways, yes, y'all, this stuff, oh my gosh, it smells so good. But anyway, so that's what I wore tonight with my little, you know, what are those tops called? Is it a peasant top? Is that what it's called? When it's like off the shoulders and it has like the fluffy, you know, wrists. I think it's a peasant top. So anyway. I love those. They're quick and easy to throw on, you know, with some jeans or whatever. But so, yeah, we had a good time and I try to get quite a few visuals for you guys to be able to see and check it out. Um, you know, us eating at McCormick and Schmix. It was nice. The food was really good. So anyways, like I said, I'm tired. This was the I look for tonight. It might be a little janky right now, honey. I don't even know because these contacts clocked out about an hour ago. <laughs> so, 
But yeah, this is it. I was rushing, so I really didn't get a chance to, you know, just kind of really show the final look. But this is what the basic look of it is. And I really, really like the glitter. I think it looks nice. So it might be a doozy getting it off, but I think it looks nice. So anyways, yeah. Um, I don't know if I'm going to end the vlog here, honestly, or if I'm going to finish it off tomorrow. We'll see. Let's see. It's Friday. Yeah, I might end it today so you guys can have something to watch Saturday and then start again tomorrow. So anyway, that's it, you guys. Um, I'm going to call it a night because I'm tired. Hey, hey.